Israel Aerospace Industries, IAI, CEO Boaz Levy announced on July 13, 2025, that the cutting-edge Aero 4 interceptor missile is approaching full operational readiness and will soon be integrated into Israel's layered air defense system. This new interceptor is specifically engineered to tackle one of the most urgent security challenges today, hypersonic missile threats, which have rapidly advanced as rival states push the boundaries of missile technology. The Aero 4 represents a significant evolution in missile defense capabilities, designed to neutralize highly sophisticated ballistic and hypersonic weapons. It boasts improved agility, advanced sensor arrays, and the ability to intercept targets at extremely high altitudes. This missile comes at a critical moment when nations such as China and Russia are accelerating the deployment of hypersonic glide vehicles, HGVs, and maneuverable ballistic warheads that evade traditional missile defense measures. Unlike conventional ballistic missiles that follow predictable trajectories, hypersonic weapons travel at speeds beyond Mach 5 while exhibiting considerable maneuverability and low-altitude flight paths. This makes their interception by existing systems far more complicated. China's DFCF and Russia's Avangard are prime examples of such advanced hypersonic weapons, capable of bypassing many current detection and defense technologies. These new missile capabilities have revealed substantial weaknesses in many existing defense systems, including some of the world's most advanced platforms like the US Patriot Pac-3, THAAD, and Russia's S-400. Their limited response time and reliance on older interception algorithms make them ill-suited to track and engage the unpredictable flight patterns of hypersonic missiles. The engagement window shrinks to mere seconds, challenging sensors and interceptors alike to act almost instantaneously. Israel's Aero 4 is a direct response to this shifting threat landscape. Developed in partnership between IAI and the U.S. Missile Defense Agency, it is set to supersede the Aero 2 system, bringing enhanced capabilities against threats both outside and within the atmosphere. Key features include state-of-the-art seeker technology for superior target tracking, greater maneuverability for complex interception scenarios, and a precision warhead optimized for fast-moving hypersonic targets. The system employs a shoot-look-shoot -shoot operational tactic, allowing in-flight course corrections and multiple engagement attempts to increase hit probability. Levy, who has overseen the Aero program from the beginning, indicated that operational tests are slated to start within the next two years but may be expedited if global hypersonic deployments escalate rapidly. The urgency reflects mounting concerns over missile advancements from Iran, China, Russia, and North Korea. Besides protecting Israel, the Aero 4 is designed for seamless integration into multinational missile defense frameworks responding to a growing international demand for capable hypersonic interceptors. Already, interest in the Aero 4 is surging abroad. Germany, a user of the Aero 3 system as part of its European Sky Shield air defense strategy, is reportedly evaluating Aero 4 to counter faster, more evasive missile threats. Its modular design allows compatibility with diverse launch systems, making it ideal for coalition-based defense structures. Additionally, its cost-effectiveness and suitability for mass production align well with modern combat needs, where large volumes of interceptors might be required to counter saturation attacks. With the Aero 4, Israel is solidifying its position as a leader in hypersonic missile defense technology, providing a ready-to-deploy solution to one of the most daunting challenges in modern warfare. As hypersonic weaponry becomes increasingly widespread, the Aero may forth prove vital for allied nations seeking to safeguard their airspace and missile defense networks against faster, more unpredictable threats.